So the first frequently asked question is how many homes do I need to see before I buy one? Ultimately, the answer here is it takes however long it takes. I've had clients who have looked at one home and one home only and know when it was the one. And I've had clients who have looked at more in the 20 to 30 home range. There really is no preset number or prerequisite or required number of homes to view. Ultimately, it's up to you. And I'd say try not to set a number or get too fixed on a number because that limits you if the right home comes along sooner than anticipated. What it really boils down to is what are your goals, criteria, and wants and needs. If you're someone who has very specific tastes or very specific needs for a home, there may only be a handful of homes to view in the first place. Conversely, if you're someone who's maybe new to the city or you have a few different places you want to live, you'll probably want to view a few homes from a few different neighborhoods to get a feel for the vibe of those areas and get familiar with the city or those communities. Really, it's all about you and your criteria, which will set how many homes we need to view. It's important to understand that there's a good chance the home out there for you may not be a thousand percent perfect from the start. The more likely scenario is that we'll find a home that's in the 90 to 95 percent match range and that last five percent or so that needs tweaking you can do as you live there and own the home this is especially the case with older homes which may have their quirks or may need a few little fixes here and there to tailor it to your needs better to all of the above point i'd say try not to suffer from analysis paralysis uh, this is a bit of an investor's term, which just means when you give yourself too many options, it creates a fear and prevents you from making a decision. At some point, you will need to make a decision on a home. Let's find one that meets your wants and needs. And perhaps if it needs a few tweaks, that's okay to deal with as you live in and own the home. Again, I don't want to set numbers in your head, but some people really want a specific answer to this question. I'd say speaking in anecdotes from my experience that the average number of homes a buyer views is somewhere around 